News 8 at 5 starts now. And we begin tonight with IT made in the Indiana Supreme Court opinion explaining why they reinstated Richard Allen's attorneys in the Delphi murders case. That's right. It'll impact the case moving forward. IT mates Cody Fisher is combing through the 17 page opinion to find out exactly how. In the 17 page opinion by the Indiana Supreme Court, they say that removing attorneys from a case must be a last resort. And in this case, Judge Goal did not have enough proof to remove Allen's attorneys. Basically, the Supreme Court came up with a new standard. Jody Madeira is a law professor at Indiana University. She broke down the new standard created by the Indiana Supreme Court. First of all, disqualification has to be a last resort. Uh, second, it has to be necessary to protect the criminal defendant's constitutional rights. Third, uh, the trial judge has to determine that those interests outweigh the prejudice to the defendant. Looking at the Delphi murders case, the Supreme Court found that Judge Gold did not follow that standard when she originally tossed Allen's attorneys off the case in the wake of leaked case information. It took a look at this and said, well, disqualification wasn't really the last resort, and Judge Gall could have done some other things. She could have fined the attorney, she could have held them in contempt uh, through imprisonment or both. While telling Judge Gold that she didn't do the right thing, the Supreme Court also went easy on her. They don't fault her. They say basically she had to do this uh, very quickly and she did not have the benefit of this rule that they uh, enunciated today. What do you think happens now? Judge Gall is actually being told to use a couple of different tools in her toolkit going forward um, and to do so in a way that would build a record uh, before disqualification can be considered. Do you see them getting removed from the case now? I think if they do get removed, there's going to be additional violations or alleged violations uh, that will warrant that removal. The next hearing in this case was scheduled for Monday, but Judge Gold has postponed that until March 18th. Reporting in Indianapolis, Cody Fisher, Wish TV, IT Mate.